Well, good morning from Studio 57 here in New York. I'm Anne Marie Green. I'm Vicki Batiste in for Vlad Dutier. So here's a look at the stories grabbing our attention right now. Inflation has cooled, but prices at the grocery store remain high. So we're digging into the latest consumer price index report out this morning and what it means for the U.S. economy. Wall Street is feeling the failure of two major banks forcing a halt in trading of some bank stocks. Now shareholders are suing. Major winter storms are creating dangerous conditions on both coasts. Uh, the Northeast is bracing for heavy snow and the West is preparing for more flooding. Plus, it's equal pay day. We look at the salary gap still plaguing much of the U.S. and how much it really costs to be a woman. And we will tell you about Tiger Woods' response to his former girlfriend, who's now suing him and wants to go public about their life together. Yeah, that's uh, we were talking about this when she first said she wanted out of her NDA. And I was saying, you know, how do you say that you're wealthy without saying you're wealthy, that your girlfriends have to sign NDAs? But we'll see, you know, where this goes and what it could be. And what's interesting is she filed a lawsuit in October where she answered the question, were you sexually assaulted or abused, harassed? And she said, no. Oh. And now she says, yes. So it's a tricky one. Yeah, it is. All right. So we'll have more on that later. Uh, we are going to begin this morning, though, with the Consumer Price Index, which rose four-tenth of a percent in the month of February. But the report shows inflation is easing year over year. Last month, inflation was up 6% compared to a year before. It was 6.4% in January. So joining us now to talk a little bit more about this is CBS News reporter Sarah Ewald Weiss. All right, so what are we to make of these latest numbers? All right, so what we know is inflation is still much too high, but you mentioned